Hey everyone, welcome back to Crown Geek. In this video, I will be explaining that how to fix application has failed to start because its side-by-side -side configuration is incorrect. Now, this error mostly comes with Google Chrome, but it can be also with other application. So let me show you that if I click on Chrome, I am getting the same message. The application has failed to start. So what you have to do first, you need to click on your search box, type here appwyz dot cpl and then you need to hit enter and here you have to look for microsoft visual c plus plus so you have to just repair this to make a right click on it click on change then click on repair click yes and once done it's asking you to restart so click on close and update the second one as well Click on change, repair, yes, close. Now if you see some more file of Microsoft Visual C++, then you also need to repair them by following the same steps. And after that, restart your PC and check back that if the problem has been fixed. So let me show you that if I still try to open it, I'm getting the same message. So what you need to do next, click on the search box, again open app wyz dot cpl hit enter look for google chrome right click on it and choose uninstall then click on yes and it says also delete your browsing data so you it's all up to you if you don't want to then you just keep this unchecked and then click on uninstall so once uninstalled you have to close it now you can open any of your alternate browser like Microsoft Edge, Internet Explorer, Firefox, whichever you have. And then you have to go to Google, Google search, type here, Chrome download. Hit enter. And select this option, Google Chrome web browser. I will leave the link in the description. You can directly come to this website and then click on download Chrome. And the downloading will begin shortly and if it doesn't start then you can click on download chrome manually okay so let me click on it and you can see the chrome has been downloaded so you need to click on open file click yes and now this will take some time to get installed so you just have to wait and it has been now installed and the google chrome is up so let me now close Google Chrome, close Microsoft Edge. And if I just refresh my page, you can see the Google Chrome icon has been uh, just appeared on my desktop. And now if I click on it, you can see Google Chrome is now coming up. So that's all guys. Hopefully this solution will surely fix your problem. And if this worked for you, then please consider subscribing to the channel for more related videos in the future. And also hit the like button. And for any question, let me know in the comment section. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.